to the very next NRL Debut Time review now, and uh, this is based on the game I was at. Obviously, just released my, my vlog in the match now, so go and check it out if you haven't already. But um, yeah, this is my um, fourth in the debut of uh, young winger Kyle Iroh for the Sharks, and uh, he is the son of uh, Kevin Iroh, who was a former player himself and the nephew of uh, Tony Iroh, so has a strong relations has strong relations to the Iros there. And um, yeah, he was previously selected in the Cook Islands team. I don't, I don't think he played, but he was just in the squ squad for this year back in May and, ju and uh, June, June, I'm, I'm pretty sure. And um, yeah, no, look, he's got a bright future, apparently. A lot of the Sharks fans rate him, and apparently he's got a yeah bright future in the NRL. And um, I, I could see why, because I watched him pretty closely. I thought he had some good moments, Kyle Iroh, but um, he did struggle at first with um, at the start with a bit of drop balls and errors, but... You know, you expect that from any rookie on debut, that you can't expect every rookie to be uh, perfect, especially in their first uh, professional rugby league game. So, um, yeah, while he did have a slow start, Kyle Ira, I thought he came back pretty well in the second half and um, did enough to, um, yeah, just get some praise and um, did enough to celebrate win on debut because obviously getting a win on debut is a very nice feeling and he got that. So, well done to Kyle Ira in the NRL debut. Um, but, yeah, no, look, obviously the game itself was very tight. Um, Bulldogs showed up a lot of effort. Uh, despite them being held to nil, um, their effort was there and um, definitely shows that they were uh, wanting to win the game tonight in, in Cronulla because it's obviously never an easy trip going down to Shark Park and competing with the Sharks who are definitely a, a great side at home. But, um, yeah, credit to the Bulldogs. They put some effort in and um, as for Manly, my team, well, I don't know if we're going to beat them because at least Dogs show a bit of heart and like that rabble. But anyway, that's a, for another time. Um, but, yeah, uh, Kyle Iroh was um, decent. He was decent and... Uh, you know, he looks pretty quick from what I saw. Made some good runs um, from these uh, right from the, from the right wing, making some runs. And um, yeah, no, it's always good to see. it's always good to witness an NRL debut on debut because obviously, as you know, I do the series of making NRL debut on reviews and players that make the play the first NRL game. And um, yeah, I've obviously been to a couple this year. I've obviously watched Justin Madden Miller from the West Tigers make his NRL debut live. I've watched K.O. Weeks and Manly make his NRL debut live. And I um, went to watch uh, Kyle Iroh make his Kyle Ira make his NRL debut live. Um, as well as uh, Bulldogs' Josh uh, Stuckey, who I'll talk about after in a separate video, made his NRL debut for them as well. So, um, yeah, no, it's good. It's good. It gives me a better review, a better indication of how the player went. But, um, yeah, no, look, honestly, he did his job, um, defended pretty well, made some good runs, and um, that's all you can ask for for a rookie in his, in his first NRL game. So, hope for the first game of many for Kyle Iroh. And, um, yeah, no, congratulations for Tim making his NRL debut in, in the final Sharks home game at Points Bet Stadium for the year. Anyways, everyone, that brings an end to the review of uh, Kyle Iroh's NRL debut. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and comment your thoughts on his uh, debut.